I am at work right now because it's a busy week, so I don't really have time to do anything but record right now on my lunch break. So, leg up. Things in life that I have overcome that I didn't expect to, but I am a better person for having done so. I went through a difficult moment on the basketball team in seventh grade because I wanted cheerleaders. And I felt if the dudes could have cheerleaders, the women's basketball team should have cheerleaders too. I went to the cheerleading coach, the basketball coach, the head of athletics, and I was like, why don't we get cheerleaders? and we were denied cheerleaders. Um, I made it through 2012. The world didn't end. That was a really big moment for me. I was preparing. Scarlett and I were buying seeds and batteries and flashlights and preparing our lives to have to go through the 2012. Didn't end up happening, so everything is good. All throughout high school, I had to deal with having glasses, braces, and severe fucking acne. It wasn't until 12th grade when I started Accutane, my braces came off, and my dad got me contacts. And shit ain't never been the same since then. I had braces on so long that I never went back and got a retainer, as I'm sure you guys can tell on my bottom teeth. But, I mean, I'm sure I'm gonna have to get braces again to straighten those, but Fucking three years of braces, that would wear a bitch down. And it did. I used to watch the show Six Feet Under with my mom. And when they had the series finale, I was a little hurt to see the show go. I made it through. And I'm better for that. You gotta learn to let go of things and people. So, you know, it taught me a big lesson in letting go. Okay, anyone in their later 20s can tell you that there's this great depression that you go through in your 20s. And for me, I never thought I was gonna get over that shit. But I survived it, learned life lessons, learned how to be a better person. If you in your younger 20s, get ready for that shit. Like life is gonna get you real good later on in your 20s. So just prepare your ass for that shit. It's gonna happen. Another difficult moment in my life was when I came out to my parents, but ended up not being that serious, so that really wasn't that difficult. It was myself making it difficult. I never thought I would make it alive through the movie Rent. That is the worst fucking movie ever made. I was in the movie theater. I paid money for that shit, so I wasn't gonna walk out. I dedicated myself to it, so I finished it the most difficult thing I have ever done in life. I grew up in a state that has really harsh winters. My body breaks down in the cold. I never thought I would make it through winter in life, but I did. I'm so grateful that I was able to move out of a state with harsh winters. Life is just so much better without all that harsh cold. That shit sucks. And then there was that one time when my hair had all fallen out because I was dyeing it different colors and stuff. And um, so a bitch was walking around near bald headed and had to go through a severe depression for about a year until that shit grew back. So there was that. So yeah, that's you know some of the things that I've made it through in life that have made me the person that I am today. Don't forget to comment, rate, like, subscribe not only to Perfect Androgyny, but to my personal channel and to follow me. Everything is below. You know the deal, the drill, all that shit. So, hope you guys have a great week, an awesome fucking weekend, and I'll see y'all next week. Bye-bye.